Open RAN is hot. Different vendors have different recipes to cater to this market. Today we look at a vendor that is leveraging the power of GPUs in its RAN architecture. We are talking about Fujitsu. Kaushik Sinha, head of Fujitsu Research India spoke to Kostup Parki, principal analyst in site research on this and a variety of related topics. In this segment, Kaushik talks about Fujitsu's contribution to the open RAN solution launched by Fujitsu in combination with NVIDIA and Wine River for NTT Docomo last year. Let's listen in. So I want to now move to the you know main topic of discussion for today. And that is uh, your product launch in the area of uh, Open RAN, which uh, was announced in February last year, along with, uh, I suppose, NVIDIA, Wind River, and you conducted it for uh, NTT Docomo. I think you launched it uh, in Japan last year. So could you uh, shed a, uh, some light on what uh, Fujitsu has contributed to this particular initiative? Yeah, sure. So uh, you're right. Last year we launched in the Docomo network, and it is um, system under deployment scenario at this time. Uh, we have long term relation with the Docomo. We have deployed systems in 4G and initial 5G for many years, including say 14 years of history. This particular solution is, uh, as you rightly said, it is also related to not only ORAN, but we use a lot of NVIDIA. Uh, graphical processing units, GPUs, mm -hmm. as you know, those are uh, very high performance acceleration SOCs. And uh, at the same time, uh, we have started with the first release, which was deployed last year. And uh, this year we are doing carrier grid release. It is open to all global customers, particularly the uh, solution you are talking about the entity Docomo network. It has got uh, very good multi-vendor collaboration because we have uh, at the lower layer a wind river platform cloud platform we call it winner cp and uh, we have a partner nvidia for the gpu environment and uh, fujitsu has a lot of innovative solutions in du software distributed unit software mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. that is all the resource algorithms on the layer two and a lot of uh, layer three um, you know, uh, procedures for rrc and uh, no mobility, etc. So this is the solution framework. Apart from this, uh, we also have uh, various uh, uh, other components in ORAN. For example, uh, we have SMO, we have EMS, and all the solution together. So this is the initial deployment. We, are, we did trial. We are able to establish initial uh, expectation on quality and, and requirements, etc. But we have been developing on this framework. Uh, especially focusing on um, graphical processing units, GPUs, mm -hmm. as well as all the advantages which comes with AIML framework along with NVIDIA software framework. Uh, so that we want to utilize because this is a solution which we call smart RAN and it has got a lot of upcoming use cases across layers, layer one, layer two, layer three. We plan to utilize in multiple use cases in coming years.